exercise 1, harder mathematical induction, series type. Prove by mathematical induction that 2 times 1 factorial plus 5 times 2 factorial up to n squared plus 1 times n factorial equals n times n plus 1 factorial for n greater than equal to 1. Right, now pause the video and have a go at this one. Okay, now 4 n equals 1 left hand side is obviously just 2 times 1 which is 2 the right hand side is equal to 1 times 2 factorial which obviously equals 2 which equals the left hand side left hand side right, so we'll label that therefore the statement is true n equals 1. Assume statement is true for n equals k. That is 2 times 1 factorial plus 5 times 2 factorial plus all the way up to k squared plus 1 times k factorial equals k into k plus 1 factorial and we'll call that our assumption statement. Now prove statement is true for n equals k plus 1 that is 2 times 1 factorial plus 5 times 2 factorial plus all the way up to k squared plus 1 k factorial plus different colour that's going to be k plus 1 all squared plus 1 times k plus 1 factorial is equal to this one here, k plus 1 after times, sorry, I'll rub that out, it's a bit tight, isn't it? So write that as k plus 1 times k plus 2 factorial. Okay, we'll call it our proof statement there. All right, again, you'll see here that, well, the yellow part there is the only thing different to this line, so we're going to add that to both sides of this one here. So, so we'll say add k plus 1 all squared plus 1 times k plus 1 factorial to both sides of A. I'll do that. 2 times 1 factorial plus 5 times 2 factorial plus k squared plus 1 k factorial. Now I'll add that to plus plus 1 all squared plus 1 k plus 1 factorial and that's equal to this one don't forget k there we go and now add that colour is quite handy because you can get a bit lost with this stuff k plus 1 all squared plus 1 k plus 1 factorial. So you see that is the same as that. And on the white writing is just your assumption statement. So you can quite easily look back and check this. If there's any mistakes you make, sometimes a visual. Okay, now, so there's the right hand side of P in there. Okay, and all this here is the right hand side of A 
All right, which we know is true. So we have to prove to prove that all this stuff here, k k plus one factorial plus k plus one all squared. You could expand this out, but I'm just leaving it for the time being. K plus one factorial is equal to K plus one, this one up here, times K plus two factorial. Okay. Left hand side equals K and a K plus one factorial plus K plus one all squared plus one the k plus one factorial equals now this is going to be take out the k plus one factorial k plus one factorial that's out of k okay that's going to be k There, plus k plus 1 all squared plus 1. So you can see by, by not expanding that, that becomes k plus 1 all squared plus k plus 1. Okay, and we've got another k plus 1 coming out of this one. It's k plus 1 factorial, and this will be k plus 1 outside of k plus 1 plus 1 you could have expanded and factorized it be okay and that would have been k plus 1 factorial k plus 1 and this is k plus 2 all right now this k plus 2 combines with that one and that gives me k plus 1 times k plus 2 2 factorial which equals the right hand side of P. Now the statement is true for n equals k plus 1. Now the statement is true for n equals 1. So by mathematical induction, the statement is true for all